Hello, 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 everyone. Happy April. Abundance April, guys. Listen, you got your girl Sabrina right here, guys. I'm super excited for this new month. Listen, March was good. March had some obstacles. March had some, you know, some little things in it you know some little kinks in it but guess what now it is a new month guys and listen everything is about perspective how you look at it right and so i woke up this morning on a natural how first and foremost want to give glory to the most high our lord and savior god right because none of us you wouldn't even be able to listen to this video right now if it, it wasn't for God, right? If it wasn't for God. And so we want to wake up and say, thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you, God, for giving us this day. Thank you, God, for waking us up in our right mind. Thank you, God, with, with breath in our bodies. Thank you, God, that everything is functioning. Like you can see, you can hear, you can smell, you can taste, you can touch, you can walk, right? You can feel, guys. So first and foremost let's get excited about that but then second of all guys it's a new start like if things didn't go the way you want them to in march no worries you're here type in the comment box i'm here like you're here you've got a new start and so it's april 1st i'm gonna start off with reading my favorite book sabrina Wright. you deserve to win right and today is number one so today's affirmation is i have confidence in myself and I am a badass at manifesting money. I deserve to win. I have confidence in myself and I am a badass at manifesting money. Think about the dollar amount you need that will pay off all of your bills, allow you to give some away, save and have fun. Write this amount down in your journal. Write down all of your bills that need to be paid. Write down the vacations you would take. Write down charities you would give to. Write down all of the things that would make you feel good about earning this money and what you will do with it. Now close your eyes and imagine for 15 minutes what everything you wrote down feels like. Keep that feeling. You deserve to win. Listen guys, everything is a feeling. All right, put feeling in the comment box and so it's april 1st it's a new month okay and so you want new money right you want a new feeling you want new opportunities you want things to, to go you know miraculous and amazing this month right and so what you want to do is you want to write down your goal we want to stay on principles the one of the one of the main principles god gave us in Habak 2 and 2 is write the vision and make it plain so write that vision down what does it look like what is that dollar amount what is that weight loss goal right what is uh, what is that is it that you want to accomplish how much is it going to cost for you to accomplish it right and then how will you feel when you accomplish it everything's about a feeling you want the new body because it's going to make you feel a certain way right you want the new car because it's going to make you feel a certain way you want the new house because it's going to make you feel a new way you want the marriage you want the dog you want whatever it is that you want you want it because of a certain feeling guys right and so all you got to do is write the vision make it plain and then imagine it already happening for you okay imagining it already happening for you okay imagine it already yours imagine that you are driving in the car imagine you've already made that dollar amount imagine you've already on the vacation right if you if you want to take a vacation where you want to go if you want to go to i want to go to paris guys i remember wanting to go to paris i wrote that vision down guys i wrote the paris vision down i imagined myself hey Aunt mary i imagined myself eating on the eiffel tower i met I, I didn't know i never knew what paris was like but i got pictures right i got pictures and so i began to imagine the eiffel tower hey i, I began to imagine you know going to shop in paris and all of that and guess what it became my reality it became my reality guys i post pictures today of me in paris it was all my imagination it was all a dream okay and so you gotta for one write this down type it in the comment box because it's a new month and i want you guys to get it okay i want you guys to get it for this month write the vision and make it 
plain. Hey, Rashina, write the vision and make it plain. Okay, write the vision, write the goal down. Okay, write it down. And when you write it down, what it, will it take for you? What would it take? We, we're not going to think about, you know, all the obstacles that may that you may have in your mind. I'm sure you got some self-doubt. I'm sure you probably feel like, you know, you, you don't know enough people. You don't have enough resource. You don't live in the right place. I'm sure. I'm sure you can come up with all these excuses on the reason why you can't accomplish your goal. Right. But you're going to just write. That's right. Write the goal down. And you're going to write down all the ways that you can accomplish it is opportunities out there is resources out there right you you're not going to think about how you can you're going to only think about how you can because here is the law if you can think about how you can't then it must it's the, that's a law of polar opposite if you can think of a way that you can't do it then you must be able to think of the way that you can do it hello if you can think about how you can't do it then the law of polar opposite means that you must be able to think on how you can. All right. And so I'm going to give you some tips on how you can get a mentor. Align yourself with someone that already has what you want. Connect with them and then be coachable and just do what they say do. Sometimes you got to borrow somebody else belief because if you've never it if you've never done it before then you don't know how to do it right and so you can't see and you don't know what they know so you just have to be able to follow directions <laughs> that's it you just gotta be able to follow directions and get your butt out the way but i don't have this but i don't have that but this but that you got to get your butt out the way you got to write the vision and make it plain hello and then you're going to use your mind to think about all the ways that you can do it. Because trust me, it's going to be things that pop up in your head, the reason why you can't. But if you can think about the way that you can't, then you must be able to think about the way that you can. The moment that thought come up in your mind that, you, that say that you can't, you say, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. You go to the next thought. As soon as that thought come up and say, well, you don't have enough money. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Because guess what? You don't need the money. You don't have to have the money. <laughs> you Now, you may have to know somebody with the money, but you don't have to have it. Right? So, we have to stop putting these stipulations and self-doubt on ourselves. Hope y'all like and share this video. Like and share. Like and share. Like and share. Okay? And then you want to create some affirmations over that goal. I'm so happy and grateful now that I have $10,000 in my bank account. I'm so happy and grateful now. I weigh 150 pounds. I'm so happy and grateful now. I have a, a, a brand new um, a Cadillac. Uh, I'm so happy and grateful now that I have a new Lamborghini. All green. Black seats with the green stitching. Black rims. Right? I'm so you're gonna create an affirmation around the thing that you want. Okay? And then you're gonna not allow anybody or no one to stop you. Period. You're not gonna allow no distractions. You're gonna come up with a routine. Stop it when you're gonna come up with a routine. My routine is I wake up, I pray, I meditate, I do some type of personal development. Maybe I read a book, even it be my book most of the time. Then I'm going to work out because here's the deal. You have to put yourself, everything that you want is on a frequency. Hey, Eric, everything that you want is on a frequency. It's on a vibration. Okay, and so you got to put yourself there. So that means that you got to do things that make you happy, things that make you excited about life because you don't know who you may meet. You don't know. That's right. Back to my routine. You don't know who you may meet. You don't know, you know, who's at what angel is sent to help you. But guess what? Stop when you cannot get there if you don't have if you don't if you're not in a good vibration. 
It cannot be attracted to you if you're not in a good vibration, if you're not on a good energy. So listen, what is your routine? I like the bubble. <laughs> what is your routine? I'm telling you, align with somebody where two or more gathered in his name than it is so. So align with somebody, get in that routine. Y'all got the same goal, right? Or y'all working towards the same things, right? You don't have to be the same goal, but y'all working towards the same things. Maybe it can be losing weight. Maybe it can be making more money. Maybe it can be, you know, a new house, whatever it is. But y'all got the same goal, a similar goal, and y'all working towards the same thing, right? And so now y'all just in sync. Y'all holding each other accountable. You working out together. You, you get you send each other good energy, good vibrations, right? You using each other resources. All right. And so guys, we gotta listen. This is why we go to school for 12 years. This is why we they teach us how to walk and drive a car. These are the things that we cannot forget, and we learn these things through repetition. So the place that you want to go in life, you're going to have to get repetitive about it. I want you to hear me. Hear me loud and clear. You're going to have to get repetitive. See, a lot of times you can't, you, you get, you don't want to do the same thing over and over again. You don't want to get into a routine where you do the same thing for a whole year. You do it for, for two weeks and then you quit. But you have a programming that has you stuck. You have a program that has you negative. You have a programming that has you with self-doubt. You have a programming where your thoughts are really not aligned with their, your goal. And so if you don't get in a routine and in a habit of keeping your body in movement, keeping your thoughts positive, and it needs to go this way for a while so it can get so it can start attracting things to you. So you do it for a day or two, you do it for a week, and then boom, you start repelling the very thing that you start attracting to you back away from you because you wasn't consistent. And so I'm telling you guys, you gotta get a coach, you gotta get a mentor, be a part of my Rick Chick Society accountability coaching. Or get you somebody that you know that's disciplined, that's going to show up and show you the way and keep you accountable so that you can stay in the routine. Because the fact that you can't stay in your routine is the reason why it's taking you 10 years. The, reason, the fact that you can't stay in your routine is why it's taking you 5 years. It even takes people to get a 4 year degree. It, it, they have to, do that, or they have to have, even have a routine for a 4 year degree. It takes four years to get a degree in something. And some of y'all won't even do, do the same thing for one year, for six months, for 90 days. <laughs> get my book. Read it for a good 90 days so that you can get into your mind and shift your whole paradigm on how to think. Because that's the biggest issue. The way that you're thinking the way that you're thinking and your routine, you won't stay consistent in a routine in the way that you're thinking. And so I'm going to help you out. I'm going to be showing up. I said the month of April is abundance. And so I'm going to do what I was called to do. I'm going to show up here every day for the month of April. Okay. Every day I'm going to show up here for the month of April, giving you a word, reminding you to work out, reminding you that you deserve to win. And that everything that you need is on the inside of you. Point at yourself right now and say, if it's meant to be, it's up to me. If it's meant to be, it's up to me. I hope you already got your pen and paper. I already hope that you wrote that down, your goal. I'm so happy and grateful now. Write that goal down. And then what is your routine? What are you going to dedicate yourself to doing every single day? I told y'all mine is waking up at 5 o'clock in the morning, praying, meditating, doing personal development. Then I'm taking my I'm taking my products. I'm getting ready to take my NRG right now. I got my workout stuff right here. I'm getting ready to work out right here in my yard today. All right. 
So this is my routine. Then I get the business. I get to doing things that's aligned with my goal. I don't get to gossiping on the phone. I don't get to, you know, going to do things that don't don't have nothing to do with my goal. That's what y'all do. Y'all write the goal down. Then y'all do things 24 hours out the day that don't have nothing to do with accomplishing the goal. <laughs> and then you look up a year, two, three, four, five years later, and you're like, damn, I haven't done anything. I haven't got it anywhere. I don't even see the goal close. So just pay attention to what you're doing every single day. Write the goal down and then your actions, your behavior got to be aligned with what it is that you want to see in your life. Did I help somebody today? Drop me some fire in the comment box if you got help today. And if you're watching the replay, guys, watch. type in the um, box replay. But I hope you got some value from this this morning. I'm getting ready to work out. Listen, if you don't have these products, listen. Check your girl's skin out. Check your girl nails out. Check your girl hair out. I ain't even have any edges. Look at that. Now my edge is growing back. I ain't even have none. I was bald. Literally, my edge is looking like my forehead. <laughs> but look at that. I got, look at that. I got edges. I got edges. All I need is my little edge control to slick them on back. And I got edges now. I didn't have edges, guys. So my Nutriburst, my HSNs, these products work. I'm telling you, they work. So get you some. And if you're looking for a way to earn some additional income, join the team. I don't know if y'all watched what happened in March, but my team went insane in March. And so I know April, they really finna tear it up. They really finna tear it up. And so we got a big event here in May. May 25th and 26th. So my team is really, really running because we're going to be on a yacht. We're going to have a big ceremony, award ceremony. Man, it's going to be awesome and amazing. So you still got time to get in. So you, you got to do it now. You got to do it now. You got to take action now. This is what the April is about. Abundance now. We're not, we're not procrastinating no more. We're not thinking about it no more. We're going to take action now. Okay? Take You don't pray long enough. Okay, you done thought about it long enough. Now it's time to take action, guys. So comment. I'm ready. I'll reach out to you. We'll run the play and let's get into it, guys. So you deserve to win. Don't forget to get your book and don't forget to get your products. All right, get these products, get your book, get on your routine, get all the way into it and stay into it. All right, guys, you deserve to win. Bye bye for now.